Hi, thanks for joining us on Celebrating Act Two. As Art Kirsch and I do, gray matters uh, once again. Uh, you know, uh, the whole purpose of Celebrating Act Two was to help you live the second half of your life to the fullest. And of course, uh, as we get older, sometimes even though we're living longer and uh, generally healthier, we need to look forward to the days when we can't take care of ourselves. And so Art and I have come up with a couple of websites we want to recommend to you today. Yeah, and uh, I uh, had a have a friend who has been going through uh, decision making about assisted living because her spouse is uh, uh, failing uh, physically, and um, it it just prompted me to take a deeper dive into. Uh, assisted living and what it costs and is any help with it because uh, we know it can be tragically expensive. So uh, sure. uh, a site that I found, which was a good overview, is uh, this one that we're looking at right here, uh, which is a great overview. Again, it's one of those companies that try to sell you services, but along with it, they give really good overview yep. of all the kinds of things that you might run into. And uh, for an example, um, uh, government assistance and because a lot of people think, well, they're going to strip me of all my assets and uh, that may or may not be true, but it's not necessarily true. And every state is different. It's a crazy quilt of laws um, uh, from California to New York and so on and so forth. So uh, this basically is a great overview. The link will be down below. I suggest that if you're before you, you get into the, uh, the point where either you or your parents may need this kind of help, take a look at this site and it'll give you a good overview of all the kinds of things that you'll be uh, uh, having to deal with. So, uh, and another site that I came up with, which I'm also going to put a link below, we're not going to spend much time on, is I was talking about that crazy quilt of sites that uh, from all over the, the, the country. Uh, that uh, whoop, so somehow it froze up here, but it basically it's going to uh, let you find out what area of the country you live in, what agencies, some are nonprofits, some are governmental, that will uh, give you a good leg up on how you might be able to find assistance or knowledge in your area. So uh, good uh, ideas. To everybody that's out there, whether you're you're immediately dealing with the chances are somebody in your family and maybe even yourself, you get to the point where you can, it's time for you to move out of your place. Don't be afraid. There are lots of things that can help you. And being armed with the information is extremely valuable uh, so that forearmed is forewarned. Yeah. John, what do you got? Uh, well, I, I followed up with this basic idea of uh, getting to the age where you really can't take care of yourself by yourself mm. with the concept of how do we, how do we maintain our health so that hopefully we can delay that day and put it off maybe forever. Mm. Um, and we've all learned, you know, over the years, we've got lots of people telling us how to live longer and healthier, but I like this website. Um, and the reason for my choice of this website is they simplified everything. Seven factors that promote good health. Just roll down and grab the headlines, Art. Um, you know, sleep, um, whatever the next one is, uh, well-balanced meals, simple articles that explain it very nicely. Um, and I really liked it. I liked it because it was kind of a short, sweet uh, article that really condensed everything you need to know um, without driving you crazy with too many details. You can always research more. Down the very bottom, I thought they had a really good uh, summary too. So since we do need to you know, eat better and live better and sleep better and all of those factors that can extend our lives, I think this is a great website. And Art, I think you picked a good website too um, because there's so much to know about assisted living mm -hmm. and uh, and whether it's for us or for a loved one. Right. I, the real, I, I think the real, the real issue is that having knowledge 
is very, very powerful so that you don't live in fear. Uh, <laughs> you may have to be in fear uh, at some point about losing everything. But um, uh, at, at some point, you if you live long enough, you're going to run out of money or you're going to have to wind up being in assisted living or something like that. Might as well find out the facts because it may not be as bleak as you think. Yep. All right. Anyway, we wish you the good health. And uh, we wish that you uh, keep your uh, information handy so that you can maintain your health and your best options for living. For more on Celebrating Act Two, visit our webpage, follow us on Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube, and tell your friends. Celebrating Act Two is the user manual for the second half of your life.